ちは、えー、僕の名前は磯崎哲也です、うん、日本で生まれて、えー、日本で育ちました、えー、30歳の時に、えー、アメリカに来て、えー、今ハーレー・ダビッソンレ,レイドローズ・ハーレー・ダビッソンで働いてメカニックとして働いていますイファースト・ジョブ・ディーゼル・テクニシャン、そう、私のプレビューズ・コーワーカーズ・スタート・ゲッティング・モーター・サイクルズ、そう、私はそれを見て、そして、私はそれを見て、私はそれを見て、私はそれを見て、私はそれを見て、私はそれを見て、私はそれを見て、私はそれを見て、私はそれを見て、私はそれを見て、I got into chopper、um, because the, all the choppers require like machining and the painting,、um, fabrication, all the stuff. And、um, I have to have a lot of knowledge of mechanics. So I'm really enjoying learning a lot of stuff. So that got me into the Uh, chopper industry. I got this bike、um, from Ohio as a project base bike, 1960 Pan Shovel. But when it came to my house,、uh, it was a terrible shape. So it fired up, but no oil pressure, and then、um, clutch didn't work, and then the transmission main shaft. Main shaft Thread was tripped, so it clearly I had to go through everything. But then somehow I got a terrible idea to make a chopper from scratch. It was a terrible idea. So, but then I got inspiration from 1920s、uh, board track racer, but no one makes that frame or anything, so I had to make. Frame, front end, gas tank, oil tank, everything pretty much. So I started making frame jig and、uh, welding table and then getting all the tools and the researching, a lot of researching, just、uh, looking at motorcycles online. So it took me nine months. So then、uh, I started making frame, but it was really challenging. Because of the engine height is too high compared to or,、uh, 1920s motor with this style of the frame. So I had to lower the engine in order to make the ratio like low and long. I made a single down tube and a double tube for the bottom rail. In order to、uh, lower the engine、uh, several inches, it was really challenging. Then I had to decide the neck angle, like everything. It was really challenging. And then the second thing was the front end. I researched a lot of things. Like I had to set a trail, and、uh, I didn't want to make it like too bulky or too wide. So I got the front 21 inch wheel first. And then I made the front end as narrow as possible. I had to make a jig as well, and、uh, a lot of sanding and filing in order to make smooth surface. It took me six months. <laughs> so, next thing that I need to mention is the gas tank. It was a nightmare. <laughs> so, because the gas tanks. Are divided by the frame. So the frame is, becomes a baseline. So all the imperfections、uh, will be noticeable, especially the curvature and the, this line. So I made four gas tanks total and then I threw them away. <laughs> I couldn't use it. <laughs> so then I needed to cut.、Uh, Cut out the bottom in order to lower the gas tank. Yeah, it, it was really hard. And then I needed to make sure there's no gas leaking. And then the oil tank,、uh, 
it was also terrible. So I made uh, five oil tanks and then none of them were working. So then this is the fifth, fifth oil tank. And then the paint. So I chose this color. Um, this is from like vintage Cadillac original color. This is really good. Uh, I had a vision that I wanted to do was the bright and the shiny. So I already decided to make all the parts getting chromed. So but I didn't want the dark color, like a black or dark green. So that color was perfect for my image. And then a uh, bunch of small parts, like foot control, tennis stand, and all the pegs. So none of them, like from the market online, uh, like manufactured parts, they don't fit because of the one-off frame. Everything is pretty much one uh, handmade. I needed to make those and then I learned how to uh, gnarling and machining, how to use lathe. It was good to learn. Yeah, my future plan is uh, I would like to, like, if I can, I would like to bring it to bone free. That, that's my big dream. Um, or I want to bring a bunch of shows uh, to display my bike. Um, and. Uh, I would like to make another bike like that. Maybe I'm thinking um, full fairing cafe racer or something like that. That would be great. I want to learn more uh, sheet metal fabrication, um, maybe aluminum fairing. That would be really challenging, but also sounds fun. Uh, I want to try that. Um, right now I'm looking for a base uh, project bike, uh, but not yet.